congratulations on your significant accomplishments. It's time to make your commencement ceremony plans. The 2023 commencement ceremony will take place at the Showware Center in Kent on Friday, June 16th at 11 a.m. To help you prepare for commencement, we plan on covering the following parts of the ceremony during this video. How to register for commencement. How to get your commencement regalia. How we plan to honor our students who are veterans. How we will offer transportation to the Shower Center or how you will be able to find parking at the ceremony. How to sign up for accommodations. What to wear for the big event. And some final other tips about entering the Shower Center. Finally, we'll give you some information about photography at the event. Graduates must register for a commencement ceremony by June 5th, 2023 at 5 p.m. Pacific to have their information published in the printed commencement program. Eligible students will receive multiple emails with registration and ceremony information. When you log into the commencement system to register, please make sure that you check your name and your degree for accuracy. Additionally, please think about using the phonetic tool so that the readers will know how to properly pronounce your name as you are honored on the stage during the ceremony. A tradition in many graduation ceremonies is that graduates take some time to decorate the top of their graduation caps, and Green River is no different. Some graduates choose to add a favorite quote, a picture, a thank you to their family and friends, or a symbol of their degree. Green River loves to see your creativity shine. Just please try and remember this is a family event. The Paper Tree Bookstore has caps, gowns, and other regalia available for purchase via their online store or their in-person store. Commencement and graduation items can be ordered using the Paper Tree Bookstore official site, which can be found on our website. Please note, some items inventory may be limited. Order your items today. Some information about graduation items. Caps and gowns are sold together as a package set. Graduation announcements, thank you cards, diploma frames, and diploma covers are available for purchase. Announcements are sold individually. Thank you cards are sold in a box of 25. Name cards can also be ordered from the Paper Tree Bookstore. Green River College recognizes its graduates, faculty, staff, and administrators for their military service to our country. A red, white, and blue military service cord will be available for graduates, faculty, staff, and administrators who meet the eligibility requirements and wish to participate in the graduation ceremony. Eligibility for this is that any graduating student, faculty, staff, or administrator who are presently serving or who have served in the military service, as well as any graduating student who has been accepted into a military service delayed entry program are eligible for the honor. If you are graduating and have served in the United States Armed Forces, Air Force, Army, Coast Guard, Marine Corps, and Navy, National Guard, and or the Reserves, and wish to be recognized, please contact Records in the Office of the Registrar, records at greenriver.edu. Those who notify Records will be added to the Military Service Recognition List and will have a veteran symbol placed next to their name in the 2023 commencement program. Students participating in the commencement ceremony are able to pick up a red, white, and blue military service cord in the office of the registrar or at the commencement check-in tables. If you are unable to pick up and would like to receive your cord, please email records in the office of the registrar at records at greenriver.edu and one will be mailed to the address that you entered on your intent to graduate from. Please notify records no later than June 2nd, 2023 to have your board placed in the mail. A free shuttle is provided for students going to and from the commencement ceremony. Seats are available on a first come, first serve basis. Shuttles will be leaving the bus circle next to the AD building about two hours before each ceremony. Shuttles will be returning to Green River College about 20 minutes after the conclusion of the ceremony. To sign up, come to the Student Union Information Desk on the first floor. For more information about the shuttle, please call 
931-631-6451. Any links, emails, or phone numbers that are mentioned in this video will be available in the description of this video. Some parking information. Accesso Showwear Center features free parking on site and in several lots within close walking distance to the venue. Parking spaces at the on-site parking lot are limited and are filled on a first-come, first-served basis. Therefore, plan on arriving early. Parking for individuals with disabilities is available with a proper state identification on-site at the Kent Showwear Center. ADA spaces are available on a first-come, first-served basis. As a courtesy to Kent Station's patrons, please do not leave your vehicle at the Kent Station during the commencement ceremony. Green River College is striving to ensure that the 2023 commencement ceremony is accessible for all participants. If you are a graduate requesting an accommodation, please contact Disability Support Services at 253-931-6460 or by email at dss at greenriver.edu by Monday, June 5th, 2023 to ensure availability of the requested accommodations. Please wear comfortable clothing as it tends to get warm in the shoulder center. Wear something light and breathable underneath your graduation gown. Are you planning on wearing heels? Maybe you should reconsider that. Wear footwear that is appropriate and comfortable. The showwear arena is all concrete on the floor and there are stairs that you have to walk up and down during the ceremony. Child care. Child care is not provided during the commencement ceremony. Security at the Showwear Center. The Accesso Showwear Center has security measures in order to continue and maintain a commitment to guest safety. This includes the following. Metal detector wands to be used at all points of entry. Backpacks are prohibited from entering the arena. Bags, including handbags and purses, may be no larger than 14 inches by 14 inches by six inches. All bags, regardless of size, are subject to pre-entry search. If you are unable to be scanned with the metal detector wands, security staff will conduct a pat-down search. Graduate portraits will be taken at the Assesso Showwear Center by Daryl Roa Photography. Cap and gown portraits. A mini studio complete with background and lighting will be set up at your event location behind the stage prior to the commencement ceremony. Appointments may be reserved every five minutes prior to your commencement ceremony. Call the studio for your appointment time. Portraits will also be created on campus before and after each information rehearsal session. Commencement Stage Candidates. Your moment on stage receiving your diploma will be photographed for all graduates. Please find more information about the photography options at the Green River College Commencement website. Now we would like to shift the attention to what you can expect the day of commencement. We are excited to help you celebrate this step in your journey. During this section, we will cover the following information. What the schedule looks like on the day of the ceremony. What you will need to do once you arrive at the Showwear Center. How you can find the correct place to line up backstage how the processional into the arena will work, and how you will proceed to the stage for your big moment. The schedule. Doors open for graduates 90 minutes prior to the ceremony. Graduates enter via the north side of the Assesso Showwear Center to check in. Guests enter via south doors for general seating. Doors open to guests 75 minutes prior to the ceremony. Graduates assemble in two parallel processional lines and ceremonies begin promptly at their listed time. Once you arrive, pick up your graduation card at the check-in under the tents by the loading dock. Dress in your cap and gown, and remember that your tassel should be on the right side of your cap. Don't worry, staff will help you to remember that. Please leave personal items locked in your vehicle as there will be no place to leave them behind as you enter the arena. The backstage area will be busy, so please look for the processional lineup banners. Again, don't worry, as staff will also be around to assist you. The backstage area will be busy, so please look for the processional lineup banners. The banners are pictured here 
as well as on your graduation card to help you find the correct area to line up backstage. And don't worry, there will be staff there to assist you. Here's an example of a graduation card for a student who is graduating with a Bachelor of Applied Science degree. You will notice their name, their degree, and a picture of the banner that they need to find. You will also have a card that looks like this to help you out. Here is an example of a graduation card for a student who is graduating with an Associate in Arts degree. You will notice their name, their degree, and a picture of the banner that they will need to find. Here is an example of a graduation card for a student who is graduating with a high school diploma degree. You will notice their name, their degree, and a picture of the banner that they will need to find. Here is an example of a graduation card for a student who is graduating with a certificate. You will notice their name, their degree, and a picture of the banner that they will need to find. The gonfalons, a fancy term for banners, are actually in full color for the ceremony and will look like this. Again, you will want to make sure you are lined up behind the appropriate one for the ceremony. Fun fact, if you are one of the first people in your section, you might have the honor of carrying the gonfalon into the arena. Again, don't worry, there will be staff there to help you as well. This is a diagram of what the inside of the Showware Center will look like on the day of commencement. There's a large stage in which the festivities will commence and four sections of seating. The two outermost sections is where the faculty and staff will sit during the ceremony. The two center sections are the areas in which the graduates will sit during the ceremony. In order to get graduates from the backstage area to the main arena, we will use the following processional route. In the backstage area, Graduates will assemble in two parallel lines behind the stage. It is critical to the success of the processional that graduates stay in two lines until they are being asked by the ushers to enter their row to be seated. Each row and section will be led into the arena behind the gonfalon, or flag, of the degree level earned. Unless you're an award recipient, there is no assigned seating for the ceremony, so you can sit next to the person in front or behind you in line. When you get to the area for students to sit, Ushers will guide you to a specific seat. They are counting the number of graduates and making sure that there's a chair for every person that they put in an aisle. But if you're one of the last people in your aisle, it's gonna feel like there's no room for you. Please trust that the ushers have counted correctly. There is a chair for you. Please remain standing during the processional of the faculty and staff, as well as the platform party. The student speaker will ask you to sit down when they get to stage. Now we've made our grand entrance, and the president and others have had a chance to welcome you, the graduates. We have honored all the award recipients, and it's time for the moment you have been waiting for. It's time for you to proceed to the stage, hear your name being called in front of all your friends and family, and be celebrated as a new graduate of Green River College. Congratulations. Just like the processional, we have developed a flow to stage that will help keep things moving effectively so that all graduates can have their moment. We are going to be honest with you, this part moves pretty quickly, and we have two readers on stage that have a lot of moving parts. Now let's talk about the actual flow of the diploma ceremony. To get everyone to the stage, we're going to escort one row to the stage at a time, and you will be guided by one of the assistant marshals, so just follow their lead. When you get to the stage, please hand your completed photo card to the photographer's assistant, and then your graduation card to the faculty reader. The faculty reader will read your name and you will walk across the stage to the trustee. When you get to the trustee, you will receive a scroll with the left hand and shake the trustee's right hand. The photographer will be taking a picture of you at that moment, so be excited. From there, you will exit the stage using the center stairs and return to your seat. We ask that all graduates remain seated throughout the end of the ceremony to help honor and celebrate all of the graduates who are graduating this year. The ceremony has the potential to be over two hours long, so think about using the restrooms before the ceremony begins. You did it. You made it to your seat, we got you to cross the stage, and now you are back at the seat after celebrating all of the Green River College graduates who are graduating with you in the ceremony. What's left, you ask? The Green River College president will close the event with some final words of congratulations and encouragement, and then we will start the recessional. 
The platform party will leave the stage with the faculty and staff following close behind. They will form two lines at the back of the arena for the graduates to exit between as one final moment of encouragement from the Green River College faculty and staff as you depart as a new college graduate. Graduates will be excused by the ushers to the center aisle and will follow the assistant marshal through the honor lines towards the exit. We ask that graduates continue all of the way out of the arena and into the plaza outside of the building. Graduates and guests will be able to meet in the plaza and we hope you have a wonderful time celebrating your time at Green River College. We would like to formally welcome you to the ranks of Green River College alumni. To stay informed about Green River College, please visit the alumni page and update your email address. We would love to stay in touch with you and share upcoming events, share what's happening at Green River College, and most importantly, possibly share your Green River story with other alumni. Well, that should just about wrap up our time with you. We hope that this video has set you up to be a successful uh, participant of the Green River College Commencement Ceremony. If you have any questions about commencement, please visit our website, www.greenriver.edu slash commencement, or send us an email, commencement at greenriver.edu. Any links, addresses, or phone numbers will be listed in the description of this video. We look forward to celebrating with you at Accesso Showwear Center. Congratulations on your upcoming graduation, and go Gators!